My name is Michael Awuna Eze. I am 78 years old. I come from Nigeria. First of all, I had spondylosis, which started 1996. I've seen many doctors, no relief. A private doctor even told me that the problem I had was what killed his mother. And that um, having said that, having had that, I felt uh, I didn't know I wouldn't, I would live, live up to uh, one year from that time. My brother's son suggested my coming to India. He asked me, would, uh, would you like to go to India? I said, yes. He started making arrangements. He told me he would make the arrangements. Fortunately, the arrangement to come to India materialized. So eventually I came to, I was brought to Manifal Hospitals. And uh, uh, I said, wow, this is a mighty hospital. So when I came here, the doctor said, the, that uh, prostate problem wasn't a problem to, to them. They would just uh, handle it with uh, injection. I was very happy. They said the, the second problem, uh, that of my spinal system, that, um, that would uh, need serious handling. The, did a number of uh, tests and eventually they came to uh, arrange for the surgery, a very serious one, um, a spinal cord surgery. It was very impressive. I don't know how they did it, but my spinal uh, vertebrae went through what I, what impressed me really. So eventually I found the whole thing had been done and uh, it remained a process of recuperation and that is what I am going through now. But I have to mention that there are a lot of things here that one yeah, cannot pass without mentioning. First of all, the people who work here, the, the doctors, they are fantastic. I have seen a number of doctors, not, a, just, just, not just a few. I've seen many doctors in different departments. They have handled one thing or another uh, connected with my problem. Um, the, the, first of all, the, the, the surgeon who did the, the, the magic, if I may call it magic, you see, is a young man who is too much. I say he is too much, and I mean what I say. The, uh, his qualifi qualifications at his age, they're fantastic. The medals he's got, medals from all over the world, they are fantastic. He has worked in the US, in Hong Kong, in many other countries, I was very much impressed. We recently operated on a patient from Nigeria, Mr. Michael. Mike was suffering from back pain and neck pain for almost 
I don't know how many decades, maybe two decades or more. And to the extent that it progressed, progressed and progressed and finally he reached us only after he lost his ability to walk for more than nine months. And then when he reached us, he was very disappointed because he was already being diagnosed with carcinoma of prostate and he was getting chemo for that and then he was also in addition not able to walk and nobody knew what's going on around in his spine. We did a fresh set of MRIs and saw that he had cervical myelopathy as well as lumbar degenerative scoliosis and his spinal cord was compressed at multiple levels both in the cervical and lumbar regions. In addition to the compression, he also had a lumbar scoliosis wherein it is the deviation of the spine away from the normal axis. In fact, we thought of a major surgical enterprise for him because that is the only way to get rid of his problem and give him a hope of walking back again. And we planned to do these surgeries in two stages, the first one being the decompression of the spinal cord at both the cervical and lumbar region and then once the patient over a period of say maybe 6 to 12 months once he is able to walk independently we thought we will do the scoliosis correction surgery. So we did, we did operate on him for almost 6 hours and uh, he tolerated the surgery quite well despite being 78 years of age and he has been now on rigorous physiotherapy and uh, his muscles have started acting and he is actually able to stand up with a walker which he has not done for the last nine months and we look forward for him to walk in the next few months or a year at max and then get back to us for the scoliosis surgery. I wish him all the best for speedy recovery and hope to see him for the next stage of the surgery. In Manipal hospitals, um, I believe I will, in, will extend my life, my lifespan.